Hey everyone, welcome back. Today, I'll be showing you how to make this epic sword, the Zenith. Let's get straight into crafting it. The weapons you will need are the Meow Mia, the Star's Wrath, the Influx Waver, the Horseman's Blade, the Seedler, the Star Fury, the Beekeeper, the Enchanted Sword, the Copper Short Sword, and the Terror Blade. Let's get into the crafting. Alright, so I just got another Queen Bee Spawner. And... What do we get? There we go, there's the Beekeeper. So that is one of the items we need. So please don't kill me. Ooh, okay. Ouch. And there we go, Planter is defeated. Did we get the item, yes or no? Dang it, we didn't get it again. Anyway, here is the Seedler. That is the next thing we need in crafting. So let's put that up there. The next couple items you need come from the Moon Lord. They are the Meow Mia and Star Wrath. So there we go. Impending Doom approaches. Oh, there we go. As you can see, the Moon Lord has awoken. Ouch. Alright, let's get out of there. Um. There we go. Let's destroy the middle eye. Uh, never mind. As you can see, I clearly don't know how to do that. But. You do need two items from Moon Lord. And those two items are the Meow Mia and the Star Wrath. So just put them away. Next, you need something from a real enchanted shrine, sword shrine, not a fake one. This is a fake one, so if I destroy it, it gives me nothing. This is what you are meant to get, an enchanted sword. Put that aside. The next two swords you need are the Horseman's Blade and the Influx Waver. There is a 16% chance you can get the Influx Waver from a Martian Saucer during an alien invasion. And there is between a 1 and 12.5% chance of getting the Horseman's Blade from the Pumpkin in one of the events. I don't quite remember the name at this point in time. This right here is the Martian Saucer from the Alien Invasion event. And this is the Pumpkin from the Halloween event. This is the Horseman's Blade right here. Put that up there and let's go get the Influx Waver. This is the Influx Waver as you can see. It shoots out these projectiles. Let's put it up at the top. Well, let's move them down to here. All right, here is the Terror Blade. If you want to find out how to make that, go click on the video in the top right corner of the screen because it is quite complex to make. The next sword is the Star Fury. So you can find them in floating islands around the map. As you can see, here's one. And there we go, there's the Star Fury. Once you have got all of the swords, come over to a Mithril or Orochalcum anvil. And then there we go. Here is the Zenith. It is an amazing sword. I mean, it can shred through the Moon Lord in minutes. And enraged Plantera in like 30 seconds. Alright, if you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to get notified when I make a new video. Thanks for watching, and see you all next time.